Right, it's uh, 4.58 a.m., so two minutes to five. Uh, that's great. Uh, Queensland time, so actually it's kind of more like about uh, six o'clock in the morning in New South Wales. So got the old trusty steed. And I'll go go for a bit of a ride. So I guess it'd be more of a, a sightseeing tour than a hardcore ride, but I'll kind of take you on the journey and point some spots out around Brisbane. It's a Martha Street. So uh, just down the bottom of Camp Hill. Going to the bottom of Waverley Road. Here's a Waverley Road. So, it's interesting to see the houses. That house is finished. Wow. Going up quick. It's quite nice actually. There's the office block. It's pretty big. There's a house. And the old house in between. Poor old guy. Yeah, that'll be gone at some point. Down to our old house. Okay, 108. Eh? Did like that house. It's very smart. Look at that, eh? Reef on. Yeah. She's doing alright, actually. Henry's old daycare. Okay. Guardian. Cool. Guardian. Kuburu. Kuburu. Okay. White Silver Reserve. So, there's good play park in there. Here we go, mate, Gravat. Done a lot of laps up this thing. So, so close to where we used to live. Uh, nice little 1.8k climb and a nice view of Brizzy at the top. Halfway up the climb. Oh, I'm to use the granny gear. Legs are definitely not what they used to be. Also a bit sore from running yesterday, so. It's a few hundred meters of the climb. Things coming through the trees. You pop out to a view of Brizzy. Pretty cool. all the time it's only about 15 minutes 20 minutes from uh, Waverley Road so a nice warm-up I used to come and do like probably five or six reps up this and then be home hour and a quarter ride good set of sessions in because all's quite pleasant but some days up here and also Mancutha it's like the Tour de France it's like the peloton going up heaps of riders but today's pretty quiet because I think we're a bit late or later sunrise was at uh, four probably about 440 4 to 45 here Green Slopes Hospital. It's where Ruby Doobie was born. Oh my god, it's riding. Oh. A little bit years ago, then here. You could do be getting bored. Hmm. The V1 cycling route, which is uh, basically runs alongside the freeway. Here we are again. Back on the Goodwill Bridge. Oh, that's not something you see every day. <coughs> basically, somebody biking, uh, pedaling along on a board down the river. Bit and then you have to, for a section, ride through the back streets to get back up down to the university. Let's ride this right now. This is a river loop. We're going to do the short river loop, I think. 
university campus right by the river right there and there's the just here bridge for people and buses it's back across the river that'll take me back across towards green slopes and rowers out in the river today thing in Brizzy, they're kind of they're not scared of spending money on bike infrastructure so there must be some guy who high up in the council I reckon who's, who likes cycling because yeah that even just that bit back there bikes big at a junction must cost a fortune to make and put up so anyway it's kind of cool bike tracks everywhere nice pleasant morning heaps of people using them as well which is always a good thing get people out at Fair Dinkum, um, just waiting for the van to be finished off. So they've done the uh, they've done the reseal of the uh, shower floor. So they're just waiting to put some silicon in, and then it should kind of be all to go. So you can see, I think he's just finished it now. Can you see the guy coming out? Yeah. And so a bit later than I expected. I didn't get away about one o'clock, but it's like quarter to two. But it's all kind of done. So she's all serviced. Uh, I just need a wash, which I'll do when we get home, maybe tomorrow, early in the morning, when it's not too friggin' hot. Uh, but yeah, good to go. So, on the way. Um, three o'clock, four and a half hour drive. Well, three o'clock in New South Wales, four and a half hours, so yeah, we're home at 7.30, so... Worked from the Fair Dinkum offices for a while until the caravan was finished. Um, yeah, no, kind of uh, all sorted. The only thing they could resolve was the decal because they hadn't uh, received it from um, Nick McCarthy, but they'll post that to me. Um, but yeah, and I can just get someone in crafted to fit it, fit it myself or something. I don't know. Um, so yeah, you know, successful trip. The other thing I managed to do as well, actually, was uh, the guy who works there managed to pick his brains about uh, what spares to carry. Um, and then I went round to one of the um, I don't know, marine and tech places and got some bits and pieces so some kind of uh, joints for the uh, water pipes if they ever break and managed to get a spare water pump as well which will fit straight in so that's kind of good so yeah I managed to get rid of spares as well um, which you can be meaning to get and order online but yeah so I guess kind of can't really complain kind of a successful trip uh, the traffic in the Gold Coast is insane it's just it's been stop start all the way you kind of hit this traffic and then you kind of clears again, you hit it and it clears again, you just never get a good run. I hate that you bloody head in. Hi bye Queensland, it's been a pleasure. Ah, uh, traffic. Yippee! Uh, welcome to South Wales. Uh, I got to Ballon the service station, I had to stop for a break, I get a bite to eat. So yeah, the EP service station here in Ballina. Yeah. A long drive, really, but it feels like it anyway. But um, yeah, it could just be a, just a whole day of running around and then uh, having to drive too. So, hopefully, she'll be home soon. Um, probably not another hour and a half to go. So, yeah, let's have a quick cup of coffee in the car park. <coughs> that's on the battery in the back of the car so I can make a cup of coffee anywhere I like.